Hello, everybody. I'm Dr. Michi. Today, we are going to study the sound U and U. Okay, let's look at the first one. First of all, let's pay attention to the bracket, uh, the International Phonetic Alphabet. The first letter B is an explosive sound, uh, so or you make a sound like B. You, you close your mouth and you explode like this. B, B, B. The second one, U and uh, two dot. Uh, two dot is a, 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 a colon-like symbol. Uh, this means to make the sound long. So U and two dot together, uh, we make the sound like oo, oo. Let's see. When you make a whistling sound, you stick out your mouth and make a shape like this. Then make a sound at the same time. Oo, oo. Ooh, this is the oo sound, and there's a, a stress a, a stress symbol over the letter U, so you have to stress. Ooh, the last letter is also explosive sound, T sound. But since this is the this is the end of the word, we don't actually pronounce it clearly very light where you can hear the sound T. So, T, or T. All right? So, B, U, T. B, U, T. Boot, boot, boot. Okay? Now, let's go to number two. The first uh, letter uh, of the pronunciation uh, is B sound, the same as the above. And the next one is U, the letter U, but without uh, two dots. This is completely different sound. Uh, not You stick out your mouth, but not uh, too much like uh, number one, U. So like this, U, uh, U, uh, U, uh. all right? You open your mouth a little bigger than the number one, U. Uh. Uh, uh, uh. All right. The last one, K, is also explosive sound, but voiceless. And again, this letter comes at the end of the word, so therefore you don't hear the sound so clearly. K, k, k. So, B, U, uh, K. B, U, uh, K. Book, book, book. All right. Okay, let's do it again. The first number one is boot, boot, boot. Number two, book, book, book. The number one meaning is long shoes. All right. Number two is book. Okie dokie, that's all for today. We'll see you next time. Goodbye, everybody.